Greetings everybody, John here with Wiki Game Guides with my S rank 0 kills perfect stealth walkthrough for the 10th mission Metal Gear Solid 5, Angel with Broken Wings. Now this is a, this ends up being another very simple, uh, very fun mission. I, I don't know what it is about like, there's something extremely satisfying about going back to these missions, replaying a mission that, uh, I mean like, you know, the 10th mission of the game. By the time that you're going to be replaying this and going for S rank, you've put quite a few hours into the game, you've unlocked a lot of stuff, and there's something extremely satisfying about going back to a mission, kind of having that memory in the back of your mind about how complicated the mission was the first time, and you know all the different ways you tried to approach it and how long you spent sneaking around the base, and then going back to that mission and not cheating the mission, certainly not, I mean this, this is how it's designed to work. And uh, is clearing it in, with an S rank in four and a half minutes. Yeah, four and a half minutes. Uh, so go to the far side of this base in just a minute here. Uh, the car with the prisoner in it is going to just drive away. So drop a couple uh, EMN mines, electromagnetic mines, on the road. And um, <laughs> I kind of fucked up during the recording. Well, I didn't fuck up during the recording. I. Uh, had a mental brain fart and still managed to pull off an S rank on this one. Uh, drop a couple EMN mines on the road. Uh, you're, you're only going to have to stun one car, but the, the tank is going to tail the car with the, uh, the hostage in it. So be aware that after the, um, after the, the primary vehicle gets, uh, gets stunned, that you're going to have to uh, uh, Fulton out the tank right behind it or else you will get fucking blown to smithereens. Oh, one way I did fuck up this mission is if you Fulton out us, but not in this recording, if you Fulton out the, um, uh, the, the hostage, then he will die during the Fultoning process. Most of the time, they just say straight up, you know, they, they don't even give you the option to Fulton the guy. But this time, for whatever reason, they do. Uh, and I just wasn't listening or I was reading the chat when I was live streaming or something like that. Anyway, so Fulton out that tank. Do not Fulton the car even with the hostage in there. So take him out of there. Um, and then basically call in a helicopter and then you just have to throw him on the helicopter. Like I, <laughs> I felt like such a freaking idiot when I did this the first time or the, the second time when I was trying to record this. So yeah, call in a helicopter, pick up support. Um, so, and I got, okay, you know what, actually, I got really lucky in this one, because I called the helicopter support there, and there's still an anti-air turret, um, and I, uh, took a lot of damage trying to leave this area, and it didn't bust S-rank for me. I got very lucky. I'm not completely sure how that works. Uh, you know, in retrospect, I probably should have called the, the helicopter pickup at the at the equidistant target that was just you know on a little bit further away from the base oh and there's I think two or three other hostages in that building and one of them uh, I think it's the hostage on the third floor is the one that um, uh, he's like the cargo transport specialist he's in the third floor of that giant castle there and he's the one that will um, help you meet the prerequisite to get the Fulton that lets you uh, lift away large vehicles like tanks and cars. And I think that's I think that's the last one. And, and like larger emplaced guns and stuff like that. So you can see right now I'm taking a lot of bullets. But even that, taking all these, like, you know, I've clearly alerted everybody and they see me and they're shooting at me. But because they're shooting at the helicopter, it doesn't technically count as uh, violating perfect stealth. So, anyway, that's the mission. Very simple way to complete it. Um, if you're new to the channel, please be sure to subscribe for more Metal Gear Solid 5 updates. Hit that like button and give this video a comment if it helped you out or just entertained you or whatever. Uh, I appreciate it. It helps me out a lot. Uh, taking, making these videos takes a lot of time and, you know, showing your appreciation. You, you guys showing your appreciation with comments and likes and all that good stuff really keeps me motivated to keep making the rest of these. Um, and uh, stay tuned and game on.